Okay, so I just got another puzzle in the post. I was uh, I was actually vacuuming my car, and the postman came over to me and said, uh, he showed me this package and said, is, uh, is this yours? And I saw it and instantly I knew it was a cube, so I said, yeah. <laughs> so um, let's open it up. I've got a feeling that this is the YJ VV Goo 2 3x3. But it may not be, because I have ordered um, a lot of uh, puzzles over these last few weeks. And it actually isn't. It's uh, a he shoe pinwheel or windmill cube. And there it is, and there you can see the uh, the he shoe logo. Um, Hishu seems to be quite an unknown brand. Um, when I've looked them up on the internet, nothing much uh, comes up about them. When I look on puzzle websites, and I've looked on a lot of puzzle websites, um, most of them don't sell any Hishu puzzles at all. And the few that do, they're always either this uh, windmill cube or um, uh, Fisher cubes, which are just where all the stickers are one colour, and that's pretty much it. Um, I know they did. Maybe they still do make them, but I know that they did used to make 3x3s and I used to have one a long time ago, but um, I messed it up by trying to adjust the tensions, but I quite liked it. It wasn't great, but yeah, anyway. So, uh, these stickers, they kind of have a sparkly effect. I think that's showing up on camera, which is uh, quite nice. So, uh, let's see how it turns. Well, let's, let's do the, uh, the checkerboard pattern on it. So there's the checkerboard pattern. And now you can see why it's called the pinwheel cube and um, it's also called the, the windmill cube. The turning isn't too bad, it feels a little tight, um, a little dry and scratcher. Whoops. But I think I think this has got the t the potential to be quite good once it's been broken in and um, and lubed. So I've got no idea how to solve one of these, but it'll be fun. Whoops! It'll be fun um, finding out, well, working out how to solve it. I'm not going to look up a tutorial. I'll just try and work it out myself because I do know I know how to solve the three by three. I know how to solve the Fisher cube, and this is basically the same kind of kind of thing as a Fisher cube. It's also the same kind of thing as a three by three. Um, so it'll be interesting to see what this is like to uh, to solve. But um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.